So yo guys, um, how are you guys doing? So yeah, we are right now playing the Announce Manager. I asked you guys on Twitter if you guys want to, wanted me to record this game or even live stream it for you guys. So I thought, yeah, I'm just gonna hop on today and just live stream it. I think the season two is on. Uh, I'm not gonna restart the game only because uh, I have made so much progress in this game uh, for quite a while now. Uh, I've been playing this since I went to Poland. I downloaded this game when I got my tablet and I have been just playing this game uh, since then. But I have made so much progress in this game. Like I am flying everywhere. I have so many aircrafts. So yeah, I thought why not just keep the progress here and. I just, right now, I just, probably just gonna open the cards here, so let's just do that really quick, because I have 30 ones to open, and we are, we can right now open some routes, to be honest, and get some air, new aircrafts up and going, so let's open these three, the middle one, yeah, we got two tickets, so we're just gonna spin those two, I have four of them, because I didn't open once, and now let's go to the maintenance manager. There's no aircraft in the repair. Please come back later. Oh, yeah. So I can't do that right now. Uh, hey, Shads. How are you doing? Um, yeah. So just type in what you guys want to... What kind of routes you guys want me to open to which countries. Because I can't do that. So let's just spin this wheel. So I have 30, 14 tickets. So I'm just gonna spin that. Alright, we at 5 million. That's nice. Yeah, let's spin. I'm just gonna click out to play. Because I don't wanna wait. Well, well, that's actually good. I need those. Alright, let's play. Out to play should do the rest. A four hundred. That's nice. So yeah, auto play is just gonna play on its own and not gonna spin it. And we got one tick one more ticket. Nice. And so let's just wait here and just open these. And we got another ticket. That's nice. Um well, wait, type which, uh, in the meantime, while we open these, type to which airport I should be flying to. So type that in, if you guys want to. Because I, get, I want to know you guys' opinions with, to which countries I should fly and to which airports in those countries. So type those in. And even more tickets. God damn it. In, in the meantime, while that's opening, I'm just gonna try to show you guys what I can win. Like, the possible, if I get three gold money bags, I get 20 million. So, I would love that more than anything. But tickets are still good. Even more tickets. Nice. But I really don't need them, but yeah. I have so many tickets, but I have only nine, eight tries left, so really no point in t of getting the tickets so I can't open them. That's one million. I just keep opening these. And guys, next time when I'm we, we live streaming this, I will probably have some music. I will just need to find a playlist with good music. I might ask Marshmallow if I can use his music, but it will take a while. 400. Guys, yes, type to which airport I should fly to. Like, legit. Don't be afraid, just type to which airport I should fly to. Because I personally really enjoyed this game. Alright, we got nothing out of that. We have 4 tries remaining. 500 tokens. That's nice. That's always good to have. And guys, this episode is just more like of uh, showing you guys 
what this game is more about. So yeah, and season two I think has started. I saw who was the winner of last time. I'm just gonna keep continuing this. In this save, I don't want to start a new airline because that will take a while and stuff like that. And I'm already almost at 2008, so you'll just see. We are just basically growing our airline. Jackpot! Let's go, guys. That's good. That is good. We got a jackpot. That's awesome. And another ticket. But I have zero tries remaining. That's three tickets. Oh, God. But I think I can use them. Because I have no much. Yeah. You already played your 20 games today. Come back tomorrow. Yeah. So we cannot play this. <coughs> anymore. So yeah guys. So this is just showing you guys how this game works. And what it is about. So basically. This game is about creating your own airline. So basically my airline. Let's just pick this aircraft. My airline is just YouTube Air. Which as you guys can see. My aircraft is just red. Has like a red line in the middle, red light, red line on the wing span, and YouTube logo on it, and on the the side says YouTube Air. Basically, what it is. Um, and right now my destinations are uh, S Seattle, Toronto, Iceland, Warsaw, Berlin, um, Oslo. I don't remember what that airport's called. Um, Lisbon, Tenerife. And Brisbane. I'm flying to these airports. I'm also flying to London Gatwick. To Italy. I don't remember which airport that is. And I believe. I'm, I think I'm not flying to Denmark anymore. I think I sold that one. But yeah. And I'm also flying to Rio de Janeiro. So yeah. And I want to open more lines. But I don't know where I, I should fly to. Guys type in where I should fly to. And yeah. I'm just going to keep showing you guys around this. Around this game, so another thing that we have here, we have this wheel which I'm just gonna quickly spin because it's free to play. And this is just oh, right, that never pops up. That never pops up. I don't know why I did this time, maybe because I'm live streaming, but yeah, let's spin this. I'm just gonna show you guys that one later. <clears throat> and we get 300 tokens, yeah, get my prize. That's nice, all right, all right. so yeah. Here we have networks, so we can see our network, like networks that I have. We can see the schedule when playing lands and stuff. We can here we can purchase our hub, so I can like buy another hub in any con with in any area that I want to. Here is the route creation, so I can purchase like like from where, so I can fly from my hub, which is Iceland. And then I can just choose any continent I want to fly to, which country, which airport, and so on and so on. But the main thing is, as you guys can see, the categories 1 to 9. So some planes cannot fly to some airports because they are bigger and stuff. So let's say I would want to fly um, an Airbus A380-800. So I would be able to fly Airbus A380-800 from Keflavik Air International Airport only because the Airbus can take off on the 8th category. So let's say uh, I can fly from there, but I need to choose an airport that has that his runway is on the 8th, that the length of the runway is 8. If not, I cannot fly to the airport. So yeah, so that's basically what those categories are. Then we have Schedule D. Here I can change to where planes fly, as you guys can see, I have most of the A320 200s. We have AMP 120, which flies just in Iceland. The same goes to 7600 VKS. And yeah, then we have the Airbus A310 300 Freyr, which is just a cargo aircraft. Uh, we have also S340B, which also flies in Iceland. Or uh, I don't remember. Because I have also, yeah, we have Q400, which is a Bombardier aircraft, which he flies to one airport, which is on the north, and that is a Norwegian airport, but I remember what the airport is called. Then we also have the Boeing 737-600ER, which is ultra-long-range aircraft, which that aircraft flies to Toronto. Um, then we are also here with 
the Airpods A3 4500, which that one flies to Brisbane. And there is the A3 4300, which flies to uh, Rio de Janeiro. So yeah, that's that. Uh, then if we go to aircraft, here in the aircraft uh, section, we can purchase aircraft. We can see our aircraft, maintenance, and we can also change the livery. Which here I can just choose an, any aircraft that I want to and just buy a livery. So for the seven to for the seventy two six hundred ATR, there's no liveries, but like for the there's also none for the Airbus A three ten three hundred Freyr. I have for the there are plenty of for the seven three seven six seven hundred ER. There are these World Cups one that just came out actually not a while ago. But there is not a livery that I would love to, which is Iceland, so I haven't bought any of them. Uh, but if they would, I would definitely buy one. Um, there is also no bond, so yeah. For the A320, there are plenty of liveries. I actually have one here, which is just... Hold on a minute, where is it? Um, I need to find this one. Yeah, I have this one, which is polygon, polygonal. I had that one, I was using that one. But I changed it when I got the new one that I have, which is just basically the YouTube thing. So yeah, that's that. Then we go move to staff. Here I can just employ, these are just employees and I can hire workers and stuff. Like right now I can just train employees. So yeah, I'm just going to quickly do that because I need to train one employee, which is this one. No. Which one was it? I can't train any of these because I have no professions in this. There are 88. I remember which employee I trained because that is a while since I logged on. I have one manager here and just plenty of managers in total in these areas. But I'm just going to take check that offline. And yeah, this is basically staff options. Then we move to financial. So here is the own money thing. So you have banks. Which, in banks, we can take loans and stuff and just go on and go on. But we, of course, need to pay those loans. So I cannot take that much. And we have plenty of banks with different kind of, like, how much you can get, how big of a loan can you get. So mini bank, you can maximum, maximal get 250. And that goes so on, so on. The best bank is CBEB, which gives you 1 billion in loan. So that's the best bank. Uh, we have the account book, which just shows me how much I have, like I'm paying, how much I make and stuff like that, and so on and so on, so blah, 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 and yeah. Then we have the cash account, which just shows me how much I also pay cash flow, and my tablet is dying, so I'm just going to quickly plug it in. Yeah, and it should turn up my screen if it wants to. Oh, there we go. My screen has turned. Um, then, uh, if it can just log in quickly. Uh, it will be a little bit laggy because I just turned it in. So, yeah. Uh, so, it looks good for you guys. Uh, financial summary. Here, you can also just see how much I have made and stuff. So, right now, I think I should be on the plus. Yes, I'm on the plus. <clears throat> my value is over 1 billion as you can see on my airline we my airline is three star airline uh, and yeah then we move to r and d here is basically how we can get more aircrafts and stuff like that so we just go to research and development basically you need to like you need to, to research stuff to get those aircraft so here we can just go in general we can just basically just get stuff that can help our airline grow and so on and so on which is basically like uh well i guess it needs to load take your time take your fucking time god damn it and why aren't you guys typing anything oh yeah oh that's cool oh i didn't see that come pop up oh well uh, but yeah guys, type it, type it in if you guys want to, like, suggest airports that I should fly to. As you guys can see, I have 
546 million dollars so you can guys just send me what i can like what to to which kind of airports i should fly to so in general we can just like research like cargo the bank so we can get more loans and yeah so i just unlocked the general too so i can just like get a new bank if i want to and just and just some basic stuff that i can just research and yeah but i clicked on the axe i didn't want to do that uh, then we have a service which we can research more service uh which is basically just like <coughs> which i can just research what people can get on my airplanes in the lounges and on the aircraft just in the airport general so yeah i have just going the safe route i haven't been researching that much in this area but i have been researching stuff and yeah Right now, I'm just going, I'm buying, like, I'm researching everything just to get everything going. Right now, I'm just going to the budget because this is just too expensive, so I can't afford that. Because this, like, l private limousines and cars, and I'm just not going to go that route. I believe I have this or this, I remember which I have on. Then I probably will get this, which is just comfort, which, yeah. Basically, entertainment, this is just price like i'm just paying less for this so yeah i'm not going to go that one i would have better entertainment um then it's just service seats and stuff in general and blah 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 so on and so on and i clicked x again which i didn't want to i need to stop do that now we have the aircraft and in the aircraft session we can just basically research what kind of aircraft we can get like right here we can get better better engines and just battle aircraft in general safety battle management and blah 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 here we can get aircraft this costs 5 billion to get a freaking hangar which is bullshit in my opinion private hangar it costs 5 billion of the like liquid development research thing uh and yeah like I can right now research for the uh, Airbus A380 800 but I don't have but I don't need to actually do that because I have no routes to fly to so basically worthless for me but yeah that's the aircraft then we can go to cargo research which is just basically cargo aircrafts so basically some cargo aircrafts here and there just full on cargo protection and just so on and so on so i actually researched the a a310 um aircraft airbus aircraft radar to get just the cargo thing going and yeah now we come to human research and here i believe i can just research in which language my uh th things oh and my tally is shutting down for some reason why are you doing that Okay, well, yeah, guys, so I think the episode is over now. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I catch you guys in the next live stream. I will probably.